Oh, I cannot wait until they fix that stupid Q system. I think it's because they like merged over Yu-Gi-Oh Pro with DevPro and the servers are all fucked up. Damn it, no dinosaurs, just a stupid... Uh. Anyways, I changed some cards around in my deck. Blaster, chain, solemn warning. Alright. And a night beam. I'm liking this card, except it can't target cards I already face up, which kind of sucks, so... It's probably not as good as MST, I just like this thing. Ah, crap, he has... He's doing... That one deck. I forget what it's called. Uh, Mermail? Yeah, that's what it's called, Mermails. I bet I can guess what that face down card is. Abyss Spear. Damn it, you suck. Let's activate Night Beam. <laughs> Good luck chaining Abyss Spear to it. <laughs> Too bad I don't have a dinosaur. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I'm just gonna have to set him. Damn it, that's what I get. I only have. Actually, no, I have 12. No, there's 3 plus. There's 9. I have 9 dinosaurs that can attack. Plus, I have a card that searches amount. So I have more than a 1 fourth chance of drawing it. Dude, I don't care if you attack. This card is destroyed. Discard to the graveyard. You can target one Mermel monster in your graveyard except Mermel of Biscunda. Especially some of the target, you can only use Mermel gun just uh, one per turn. Oh. Yeah. Finally, Hydrogen Dawn. That's good. I was kind of hoping it would be a fire type because of Blaster and shit. Nope. Nope, let's not activate. Okay, what is this card? You can special summon any Mermel. This one's just one from the grave. This card is discard to the grave. You can target one Mermel monster in your graveyard, except this guy. Special summon the target. Oh, only if it's discarded. Oh, so it's like the Atlanteans, kind of. All right, Hydrogen Dawn. Go crazy. Yes, let's use Hydrogen Dawn's effect. And special summon out another Hydrogen Dawn. And let's attack with that Hydrogen Dawn. Even though I know he'll summon out that one card. Cause I don't care. Let's bring out a third Hydrogen Dawn. Oh shit, I forgot I could've used Solemn- oh. Whatever, I'm just gonna wait for him to go into an XYZ summon and solemn warning that. Come on, bring out your level 7 Abyss Gogolus. I think that's what he's called. I'm not 100% sure. Ginku World. Damn, you're taking a long time to choose that one card. Unless you're double guessing yourself and thinking you should pull out another one. Even if he does, let's see. Hydrogen Dawn can go up. Hmm, it can go to 2100 with Blast Chain and then reduce 800. So as long as this card doesn't have more than 2900. Ooh, Abyss Steel. Really? That card is terrible. Uh, what can I do? I can discard three water monsters you control, spell some of this card from your hand. When you do, target one Abyss spell card in your graveyard, add that target to your hand. You can drew one other. Uh, send one random card from Yoda's hand to the graveyard. Meh. What should I do? I could attack over him. That's 21 minus 8. But I can't bring out a third of uh, another Hydrogen Dawn, so there's no point in doing that. When I can just go for a rank. Let's see, what do I have? Any good ones? Ouroboros? Yeah, I can just banish or return it to his hand. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Mmm, yeah, let's just go into main phase two. Special summon out. Let's see. Should I go into Ouroboros? Target one card, send a random card from your opponent's hand to the grave, banish one card in your opponent's graveyard. I can return it to his hand, or I can bring out that guy, which is actually good. Or I can use Digosti. Um, eh. Let's just go into an Ouroboros. 
Might as well, right? Yeah, and then I can just negate anything with my awesome solemn morning. Really an evacuator. Um. Oh wait, no, Lance won't do shit to evacuator. Ugh, that sucks. Well, whatever. I have to wait till my next turn to use any of his effects. That kind of sucks. But I do have a nice way to stop him from doing stuff. Look at this. Look at this back row. If he MSTs this guy, I can just chain it to Evil Swarm. There is no monster he can summon out that has a higher attack than Ouroboros. Yes, let's... Oh, he brought out that card. Uh, Use Blast Chain. He has that one card where its effect only activates with all monsters who have a less attack than them. So, but I'm not sure if it's monsters with less printed attack or not. Either way, I'm going to Solemn Judgment, judgment it as soon as he brings it out. Because he can't attack or over Ouroboros. Go ahead and special sub in your monster already, it does not matter. Damn it, I still don't. I can't bring out Blaster. Blaster's probably not great if I'm running Triple Hydrogen Dawn. Well, that's the only water monster I have, though. Send one of the water monster. That one's actually not half bad. Nope. Wait, why did he. Oh, he activated the effect to. I see what he did. He activated a second effect to send one of his cards from the deck to the grave. Ooh, big guy. I forgot big guy was an option. Yeah, well of course he gave up. I destroyed him with my hydrogen done. Alright, this version of it seems to be okay, it's just that blaster and hydrogen done don't mix very well. Alright, and here's the updated deck profile, the one I just used. Um still triple blaster, triple velo. Triple Jurakaraba, Triple Hydrogen Dawn, Triple Aleo, uh, Triple Fossil Dig, added in Dark Hole, added in Golden Sarcophagus, uh, still the Triple Night Beam, Double Lance, took out one Megamorph, so there's only two now, uh, one Bottomless, one Torrental, still Triple Survival of the Fittest, because that's what I base this entire deck around is using this card, a uh, Double Skill Successor, because it seemed to test well, uh, one Evac Device, Blast the Chain, Fiendish Chain and Solemn Morning. Fiendish Chain was the added in, because I forgot to add in some way to negate spell. I mean, to negate monster effects, and you need that in any deck. And for the extra deck, I didn't substitute anything, because it seemed fine. Ouroboros, he's, he's a good option. 